welcome to online physical science class for class 10 today's topic organic chemistry subtopic IUPAC nomenclature in this system what is what do you mean by the nomenclature nomenclature is the naming of a compound but naming of a compound are usually two types common system or uh, tribal system and second is IUPAC system in common system which was earlier a stage use uh, one example is there urea in common system uh, comes from urine formic acid comes from formaceous means ant red ant and acetic acid comes from acetum means vinegar citric acid comes from citrus food and mass gas or methane comes from mars land but nowadays this uh, naming are irrelevant that's why we go to the second uh, system that is IUPAC system in this system here it is IUPAC system in IUPAC system before go to the IUPC system, few uh, other example of common uh, or tribal names like acetylene, C2H2, but in IUPC system it is name is ethane. In comma, uh, similarly ethene in IUPC name, but common name is ethylene. Formic acid, common name is formic acid, but in IUPAC system, it is named methanoic acid, HCOH. Now we go to the main topics, IUPAC system. In IUPAC system, there are three parts. One is root word, second is suffix, third is prefix. In root word, uh, the number of uh, carbon atom that means if the carbon atom is 1 root word should be methane meth or if carbon atom is 2 c2 then root word will be eth and if carbon atom is 3 root word should be prop and if carbon atom is 4 root word will be but this is called root word now go to the suffix in suffix are two types primary suffix and secondary suffix in primary suffix if there is carbon carbon single bond then we will name as a n e n n if carbon carbon double bond name will be in and if carbon carbon three uh, triple bond name of the compound will be in in the secondary suffix you look in the the use of secondary suffix are depends upon the nature of functional groups now go to the prefix prefix when one or more hydrogen atom are replaced by a group or groups it is called derivatives or the name of the derivatives is written as prefix with a preposition proposition for example ch3 ch2 ch and cl here 2 chloro is deri derivative and is prefix as 2 chloro look h is replaced here h is replaced by 2 chloro next we go to the one few example then you will be clear before we go to this example what are the rules of writing uh, uh, nomenclature rules for nomenclature 
longest carbon chain should be chosen first functional group must be within functional group must be within the chain numbering is done from end of the functional groups fourth point is all compound are named after alkenes and fifth point when hydrogen atom to replace by other atoms or groups it is derivative the name of the derivative should be written first with its position in alphabetical order a hyphen is placed after this for two three groups same kind tri di are used name of the substituent are like f for fluoro cl for chloro br for bromo i for iodo uh, no2 for nitro ch3 for methyl in this way here is a homologous series i am giving over a alkane functional group one single bond that's why number uh, of carbon atom will be plus n alkane c1 if it is c1 methane if a carbon atom is c2 then it is propane look propane butane in this way next uh, if the carbon uh, alkene group is alkene group then c double bond o here c uh, to the carbon atom it will be alkene ethane propane butane in this way next one example you will be clear what will be the one example is showing over here suppose uh, this is the uh, formula of uh, compound you have to be in, name it in i upc name to methyl butane how it is done in first uh, carbon atom uh, one then two three and four and ch3 methyl is on the second carbon atom that's why it is name is two methyl number two carbon atom that's why it is written two methyl bromine similarly if we go to the this one first carbon atom it is second third fourth bromine is on the second carbon atom and uh, chlorine is on the third carbon atom that's it is name will be two bromo three chloro butane butane means four carbon atom is there that's why butane here uh, look another example this is double bond that's why it is end with e n e n one carbon two and three three means pop prop n this one is two methyl propane methane methyl methane is on the second carbon atom that's why it is written two methyl propane in this way naming is done hope you understand my video thank you for watching till then bye see you on the next video okay